everyone and welcome to the housewife channel my name is Marge and today I will share with you two of my family's favorite recipes steak parmigiana and passion fruit mousse so without further ado let's go to the first recipe steak parmigiana okay so here I have six six now eight uh, pieces of meat they are already seasoned with chives and onions and garlic and salt here I have one light beaten egg with some milk, some bread crumbs, and then I leave a plate here so that I can put the meat in when they're ready. So the first thing I do is I get the meat, then I put it in the egg, then I put it in the bread crumbs, and then I put it here. Okay, so let's get the meat. Put it in the egg. Then on the breadcrumbs. And then I put it on the plate. It's like this because I freeze it. So I buy a big piece of meat, then I cut it in little pieces, and then I beat the meat and I season it. And after I season everything is that is when I freeze. So after when I pick up, it's already seasoned and it tastes really nice because the seasoning stayed with it when it was frozen, so it's delicious, very nice. Maybe my next video will be about that. My kids just love this recipe, it's very, very nice. Tastes really good. And we eat it with rice. You can also have some potato chips if you want, but we don't really like potato chips, so. Okay, so I'm done. Now what I'm going to do is wash everything. So here's the meat ready to fry. Here's my frying pan. And here's where I'm gonna put all the meat that I have fried already. So let's put some oil in there. You have to put quite a bit. Otherwise it's not gonna be good. Okay, I just put the meat straight in there while it's still cold, then I know when it's ready. And the oil is gonna start frying everything, so I'm gonna have to add oil while I'm doing it. Okay, so it's frying and it's almost ready. So then I keep it up like this. Let it drip a little bit and then I put two. And I start putting all of them in a way that they are going to be organized in here. 
so that when I put the sauce and the cheese on top, it's going to be great. So this is the first layer, can you see? And then I put the rest of them, I'm going to put on top of these ones. Okay, so here's my meat. Hope you don't mind, that's the washing machine. I put some tomato sauce. I use two of these. And then it gets really thick, so I mix with some water. Just a little bit to get the, the bottom. The sauce that was on the, stuck on the bottom. And because we love the sauce. <laughs> okay, so now I'm gonna put the cheese on top. Then I sprinkle some oregano. And I put it in the oven. I don't leave a lot in the oven, just so the cheese starts to melt. And then it's ready. Okay guys, that's the parmigiana. So take a look. See that the cheese melted? And when it was on the oven, I could see some bubbles. So that's when you know it's ready. Okay, it's ready to eat, and here the rice is almost ready, so I'll show you on a plate later. Okay, so now we're going to make some passion fruit mousse. So this is what you need, passion fruit juice, you need a box of milk cream, and condensed milk okay so first we put the cream then we put the condensed milk this is the easiest dessert you can make and the kids love Sorry again about the washing machine. My kitchen is very small, so you can hear the sound. Then you get the juice. And you put the same measurement as the cream. Okay? And you put the lid on the blender, that's what you're gonna have. See? So then you just put it on a, where you want to serve and put it in the fridge. Hope you all liked the video and the recipes. Make sure you try them at home and leave a comment down below telling me how it was. Uh, don't forget to subscribe and, and put the little bell icon so that you can get notified every time I get a video. I post a video. And I hope you like it. See you on the next video. Bye.